And right now, all lanes on I-85 southbound are back open after a crash left a car up against the wall. Our very own Crash Clark is here for midday to tell us about the traffic woes this morning. As people went back to work for the holiday, it's getting out of control out there. It really is, Fran. We've got to re-educate ourselves on these rush hours because we will be back in business when it comes time for back to school. This is how the rush hour started with a massive tractor trailer fire on 285 eastbound at I-75. All lanes were blocked at one point. We saw huge delays this morning on both 75 and on 285. Now let's show you some video of the wreck we just got rid of. This is a car upside down vertically against the wall on 85 southbound between Claremont Road and North Druid Hills. This was a horrific wreck. In fact, it's not too far from the station. As soon as I saw this was happening, I ran out there with our photographer. We got this video here on the scene. Another vehicle completely destroyed as well. We do know there were some injuries. We watched EMS leave the scene here, but again, all lanes have been reopened. Folks, we are getting back to school. We are getting back to rush hours, and if you think we're done at 1130, 34. Look at this brand new trouble. Another injury wreck 75 southbound at Windy Hill. Several right lanes are blocked. Expect delays out of Cobb County. If you're getting ready to head out for lunch, may want to consider Cobb Parkway. Francesca.